Your rumours here with a FIFA 23 player review for 83 rated inform Nuno Mendes. So he stands 5 foot 9 inches tall. He has high medium work rates, his preferred foot is his left, and he has a 4 star weak foot alongside 3 star skill moves. I bought him for 83,000 coins, however, he has just come out, so I do imagine him to drop around the 20k mark. The informs are really not holding value at all this year. His preferred position is left back and also play left wing back. His club, Paris Saint Germain, he's got the League One links and the Portuguese links. A few decent players for him to link to, Renato Sanchez, you can link him to Mbappe, Neymar, Messi, all those sorts of players. So that is good indeed. I've stuck an anchor on him, makes him the controlled accelerate type. It boosts his acceleration up to 97, sprint speed up to 96. Shooting stats, not the best, we won't go into that. Passing, short passing at 81, long passing at 74, not the worst passable. Dribbling stats, all around the 80 mark, should feel okay in game. His defending stats, not the highest. Interceptions boosted up to 82, heading accuracy 76. Defensive awareness 81, standing tackle 90 and sliding tackle 86. His physical stats jumping up to 82, stamina 84. We'll see how that affects him in game. Strength 81, not the worst. Aggression also up to 81, not the worst. His traits, he's got the long throwing trait and the speed dribbler trait. I've actually used his gold card quite a bit at the start of the game and I thought he was pretty consistent. So interesting to see what this card will play like. I'll be playing him at left back in a 4-2-3-1 narrow. Yeah, let's see how he plays. Good tackle by Nuno Mendes there. Messed up with the clearance though. Good tackle again by Nuno Mendes. Nice little one, two and some acceleration there by Nuno Mendes. Oh, just offside, unlucky. Nice switch of play by Nuno Mendes there. Good inception by Nuno Mendes. Nuno Mendes left for dead there. Gets back, good block to get back at him, Nuno Mendes. Good inception there by Nuno Mendes. Oh, that's unlucky, that pass. And we're gonna concede from it. Oh, how unlucky can you get? Dear me. Nuno Mendes on the left wing. Can he get a ball in? Far post. Oh, Sterling got his head on it. But it's a goal kick. Good interception there by Nuno Mendes. That was a definite goal. Good play to get out as well. Oh, Mendes does well against Traore there. Honestly, how are people using Traore? <laughs> Let's see how he defends against Traore this time. Oh, Traore gets past him this time. Nuno Mendes, not the most agile on the ball, I have to say. Adama gets behind Nuno Mendes and pushes towards the box. Doesn't really have the recovery pace, I'd say, Nuno Mendes. Nuno Mendes up against Traore again. I have to say, Traore is getting the better of him this game. Nunes beaten there quite easily, and they've got another goal. Not the strongest defending there. Don't know if I said Nunes there or Nuno Mendes, so I meant Nuno Mendes. Good cover by Nuno Mendes there. Nuno Mendes trying to get back on this. Being to it by Bellingham, not really sure what happened there. Nunes can't get back on Anthony. Marquinhos comes across to help. Oh, good play by Nuno Mendes there. Passes back to the keeper to stay safe. Oh, 
Oh, good pass through by Nuno Mendes. Nuno Mendes slow off the mark there. He's made the run though. Gets blocked off by Varane. Good inception by Nuno Mendes and some strength there. Haaland falls to the ground. So after three games, we didn't get any goals or assists with Nuno Mendes. But that's not what we're looking for. He is a left back after all. If I could quickly just ask you to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. That would be greatly appreciated. Thank you. But my opinion on the card. Not too impressed I have to say. Feels like a pretty generic left back. I mean it says 92 pace with the anchor that should be boosted. Didn't feel anywhere near that pace to be honest. It felt sort of like the mid 80s. So I wasn't too impressed with that. He was quite slow off the mark as well when he was running. His defensive stats. I mean okay tackling sometimes but again not what I'd want with my left back he doesn't really have it I think players like Teo Hernandez and Mendy those are the sorts of left backs that you should be going for over this card but yeah it just doesn't really play up to the stats which is quite disappointing I played with his gold card early in the game and it was pretty consistent but this one it was just beaten too easily for me however it does have good links with the PSG players Neymar, Mbappe, Messi, uh, Renato um, so it may be one you want to get in your res this week of course there's not too many other good players in the team of the week so still one that you could look forward to if you decide to play the weekend league you might decide to grind out the world cup tokens um, instead of the weekend league this weekend but yeah that's my opinion on the card please like subscribe and comment if you appreciate it take care